we have our next wine, which is a Merlot. And uh, the name of this Merlot is Negro Amant. Negromant. Negromant. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Which actually means, uh, huh, it would, the literal translation would be Black Wizard. Black Wizard. Yes. At first, I cool you know man. I thought the name uh, I thought uh, I was thinking of Negro Amaro, no, so no, 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 no. <laughs> Italian no, no. Negromant. So, okay, uh, it's a Merlot 2018. Team? Yes. A very um, very popular Merlot in the Romic area. In fact, when I used to run a restaurant, this was our best-selling bread by far. Um, and for a reason, it's a very good food wine as well. But um, let's uh, take it one step at a time. Uh, a few words about the uh, vinification process. Well, it's basic, basically the same as the Cabernet. Mm. So uh, we did all the same, although, although uh, we changed the uh, we changed the type of the what's the word? I got a little bit drunk, guys. <laughs> so uh, uh, yeast. Yeast, ah, there yes. you go, yeah. We change the yeast, of course. Every variety has a different yeast, according to, to the variety and the thing I want to do with uh, mm -hmm. with with that variety. So uh, and also it was aged in both Croatian and the French oak as well. Yeah, one year. Right. So uh, by the way, the Croatian oak has been used a lot and it's still used all around Europe. Mm -hmm. It's a wonderful wood for uh, uh, barrel making. Uh, and does uh, um, it contributes a lot uh, of great things yeah. um, a bit uh, more harsher a bit more rugged than French oak I mean the effect it has on wine it's um, more tan it will imparts more tannin yeah and also to the wine the wines are more robust yeah you would say so yeah. so if you know Italian wine you would have heard of Slavonian oak yeah. Slavonian oak actually comes from Croatia yeah, yes. yeah? Slavonia is not Slovenia, it's in Croatia. <laughs> a lot of people confuse it. Oh my gosh, the, the, yeah. the, uh, some of the winemakers, I'm not going to name names, yeah. but I was on one of the shows when uh, we met in Hong Kong, I was on one of the wine shows and one of the Italian winemakers told me, well, these were aged in Slavo uh, Slovenian oak. I said, well, do you maybe mean Slavonia? And he was like, well, that's the same thing. No, it's no. not the same thing. Completely Slo different. Slovenia is a country and Slavonia is a part of Croatia between the borders of uh, Bosnia and Herzegovina, Serbia and Hungary. So Hungarian oak, Croatian oak, I think have a, some similarities yes. Yes. as well. So, the wine. Well, you get the varietal nose bouquet of, uh, of the Merlot, that's for sure. And uh, again, com yeah, compared sorry. to the Cabernet Sauvignon, I think it's lighter. Hmm. So I was thinking, why are we starting with the Cabernet Sauvignon and then moving on to Merlot? Because this one has more alcohol. Yeah. Ah, okay. <laughs> yeah, but it, it might Lighters be the body. It yeah. might be the lighter body. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. And then the Merlot, it's the acidity is higher. Yeah, yeah. Um, acidity, there, there's this um, sort of a fruity, juicy character to it on the palate mm. that, um, again, uh, refreshing. It, it definitely keeps the wine alive. Mm. Um, not overpowered by oak, I would say. Uh, oak, very well present. Mm -hmm. We are talking about barrique barrels for. Uh, you just use barrique here, right? Yes, just barrique. Yeah. yeah. Um, but uh, in, I think in no way overpowered by oak. So uh, plenty of primary aromas coming to the forefront uh, on, the, on the nose, but on the palate as well. Well, I would say it's, uh, it's actually very hard to make a Merlot with character. And, mm. you know, he has achieved it. Because yep. uh, this Merlot is probably one of the best single varietal Merlot mm -hmm. I've, I've tried because it's it's a grape that's very tricky. It, you know, it's so easy to drink grape, grape variety, but then it's hard to hard to impress you with yeah, 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 yeah. with this yeah, yeah. grape variety. But this one is, is quite impressive actually. Can I can I have some more? Sure. <laughs> um, 
we're i like this so much we have to we have to mention that we are filming this on saturday so we're just going to continue with the party after this yeah and you see it it's a guarantee when when you see the the winemaker keep drinking his own wine it makes it means that the wine is good yeah don't trust these guys in Cornell though they are tricky but yeah a very nice merlot mm. again best seller uh, and for a reason uh, this is uh, what how long have you been making this wine under this name uh, since 2010 right so yeah. 10, years. 10 years in 10 years it garnered quite a following on the local yeah. market mm. so a lot of people in this area now know about Negromont um, you know as, as, as a brand of its own if you will yeah. Um, and of course, there's usually a reason for that. 